Hi, in this video, I'm going to be talking about the three best text-to-speech apps specifically designed for YouTube or that is very suitable for YouTube. And I'm going to go over them each individually and tell you why. So the very first one is Murph AI. And the reason why I chose this one is because it's the most realistic text-to-speech on the market that I've seen. And I've tested a lot of different text-to-speech apps. So if you go into here and you go sign up you can see a whole bunch of different um, voices that you can choose from but I've already made a few so I'm gonna go ahead and play a demo so you can uh, get a feel for how realistic the the voice is and what you what you can expect from a finished product using Merv Studio and I'm just going to share copy link and paste it okay and then we can preview this real quick let's take a listen how to train a new dog introducing a new dog into your home is an exciting but anxious time it can be even more stressful if you have recently brought home a puppy or adopted an older dog who doesn't know how to act around other dogs both of these factors mean that new dog training might seem like a daunting task. However, with some preparation and patience, it won't be... Hey, I've been getting a lot of questions again. I've mentioned in another video how to make money with YouTube using AI tools to automate my channel and to save time while building traffic. So hey, if you're interested in how to make money with YouTube using AI tools to automate a lot of your work and to build traffic, uh, I'll put a link in the description and it will take you to the course where you can see how I do that. It's just there for people who are interested. So let's get on with the video. Okay, so as you can see, it's quite realistic. It's very, very realistic. Um, <clears throat> the only downsides to, to using this software is that it doesn't have an integrated gallery yet. So what I mean by that is, let me go back and show you what the video creation process looks like. So all these videos right here, I had to basically use, I had to download them and then upload them here and then import them into here. There is no gallery feature where you where you just click and you select from a, a whole bunch of uh, videos and then just drag it in here. That's the only downside. But the plus side is, you know, we're here for the, if you're talking about the text-to-speech and how suitable it is for YouTube, this one's suitable because it has the most realistic uh, text-to-speech on the market available. All right, so let's uh, Murph AI. I'm going to leave in a link in the description, and if you happen to click on it and buy or purchase, um, a membership through my link then I happen to make a small commission and it helps this channel out so I get to go ahead and test new tools and new toys and share them with you all right so that's that's this one let's move on to the next one the second one is the free is a free one uh, I want it to have one for each you know at least one for each person if you don't have the cash I understand uh, this is called uber duck and it's an open source voice AI community so basically you can go ahead and you can create uh, different different things. Uh, the, the one I'm talking about is text to speech. You just go ahead and click into that. And the reason why this is is fun is because you can use a whole bunch of different cartoon characters, different fictional characters. You can use celebrities. You can use a whole bunch of different. Um, they have a whole whole list. Uh, they have uh, that's they, <laughs> they have just a lot, a lot, a lot. All right, so let's go with. Hmm, someone I, I know. Let's Okay, let's go Diablo. Something Let's see. Let's go Diablo. Let's see. Despicable me. Yeah, Diablo. And I'm going to go with uh oh, you can you can pick the characters here. Uh Mr. Conductor. Oh, that's a dinosaur train. Let's see. Oh, let's stick with Diablo. Okay, so let's let's tr type in some kind of text in here. Okay, 
Okay, so I, I signed up for Diab um, show Diablo logged in. I'm gonna say hello, my name is let's see how it goes. And scroll down real quick and you hear it right here. Hello, my name is Kasha. All right. That that sounds pretty accurate. Now, there's a whole bunch of different uh, other ones you can do. I'm not, I'm not going to go through all of them, but you can see how this can work really well for a YouTube video because you can do things for, like, fun. I have different, you know, let's say you, you're doing some kind of um, uh, narration, storytelling, or you're just doing some kind of... Uh, tutorial and you want something funny to pop in every now and then you can simply create your own fun you know uh, celebrity or cartoon uh, voice using this software and it's all for free like there's it's it's very very generous free free software I've never had to ever feel the need to upgrade all right so that's uber duck and then the last one is very interesting in its own right and this text to speech is called descript now the transcription has just gotten a recent update so it's a lot more accurate than it was before before it was basically unusable <laughs> but we're not here to talk about the the, the, the transcription uh, which is just a bonus we're here to talk about the text-to-speech and this is amazing um, what it does is it allows you to clone your own voice convert it into a text-to-speech and then all you do is just type in the text and it just makes basically has your text-to-speech your clone tech text-to-speech read it out to you that's why it makes it so special so things like uh, if I have some kind of condition with my throat that I can no longer talk <clears throat> or if this is I don't have the the sound condition where you know I'm next to a construction site 24 7 or a major highway I can go ahead and just type in the text and it, it's me speaking it so I'm gonna stop I'm gonna be quiet and I want you to listen this is this is the text-to-speech clone version of my voice and 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 see if you can hear the difference all right I'm fairly new to sailing but was at least able to finish my first beer can race without incident last weekend and feel decent about the basics and wondering what the maximum safe amount of people to fit on a 27 footer for a day sail in LT wins I'll still be able to sail W. Oh, the engine. All right. So as you can see, this this text of speech is hyper realistic because it's actually using a real person, you, <laughs> as as a voice. So uh, this is very much very very suitable for YouTube because you're basically saying everything. It's just you're having the machine say it for you using AI. And the, the, there is a downside to this, and let me tell you what they are. Uh, with this software, the downside is the uh, what was it? The transcription is it's decent now. It's decent, but it's not great. So it's about like ninety percent accurate, depending on uh, how well you speak and how clear you sp how clearly you speak. I'd say about ninety percent, which is not not too bad. It's probably top top tier, maybe top five, top ten when it comes to transcription. Now, just recently, before it was just junk. Uh, the other thing is. Uh, you have to train. You kind of have to train the uh, the the AI to be able to recognize your voice and 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 clone it. So it takes about they say about I don't know five minutes of of reading a script. But I, I found that the the longer I train it, which is like you know every time I produce a video using this software, I basically let the AI kind of get more information to make my voice sound more realistic so the more you train it the more realistic it becomes in the beginning i sounded like one of those hello welcome to one of those reddit voices hello welcome to this you know reddit post today we were talking about whatever it sounded pretty bad you got the like the the, the scratchy background but over time it, it became something like this anything i should know about sailing with more people aboard i'm fairly new to sailing but all right so that that's that's pretty that's pretty neat um, those are the three best text-to-speech, in my opinion, uh, that's suitable for YouTube because of the, 
you know, the fact that they're very realistic or the fact that you can use a celebrity voice or a cartoon character's voice or the fact that you can use someone else's realistic text-to-speech voice. All right, so if this video was helpful, can you please hit the like? I'm Vince from Digital Man Institute. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.